What is up, guys? This is Rocket Gamer. As you can tell by the title, yeah. Um, if you guys don't know what the Las Vegas Massacre is, it's basically. I can't get into my car. Um, basically, some guy with 12 automatic rifles decided he was gonna shoot up a Jason Aldean concert, killing almost 60 people and injuring more than 200 and I'm really infuriated by that no I'm not gonna have a big rant or freak out I mean yeah I am who can brain themselves to doing that it's unbelievable and like my heart goes out to the victims loved ones family anybody that knows someone that got killed and that it it's just devastating. I mean, like, it's one of the biggest um, massacres in our country, basically. And I thought ISIS would step up their game, really. I mean, come on. But, um, yeah, it's very sad time. And you just don't think it's going to happen to you. Really, people that don't know when it's going to happen. Like, people that didn't say goodbye, really, to their loved ones. And I can relate to that way. I couldn't say goodbye to my grandpa Charlie because I was at my friend's sleepover. And I regret that day. I really do, do regret that night. Like, I wish I could go back and say goodbye to him. But life is life. That's, that's really it. Life is life, so. And on... So far, none of my f family was at that concert, so that's good. But, um, if anyone, please, like, I know I'm playing the worst game to be talking about a sh massacre, but, um, yeah, decided to play it for no reason at all. And, really, it's a sad time. I mean, who can bring themselves to shooting up a concert? I mean, literally, like, I was watching CNN, shout out. Um, I was watching CNN, and basically, this young lady um, was, um, I think this husband shielded her from the bullets, but he didn't make it, which is very sad, honestly. And um, I go out to the... I mean, I'm not ranting on anybody. I mean, I'm ranting on a shooter. Like, why would you do that? Why? It's dumb. It's dumb to shoot. Like, like, like honestly, in this game, in this game, I would shoot up at least 5,000 people, honestly. But it's a game. Uh, in real life, it's not a game. He has a screw missing in his head. I'm not taking sides for him or anything. I'm just, oh, my God, like. The stuff that happened in the last 15 hours, god, jeez, um, like, they're finding out, like, like, they used his, um, girlfriend, fiance, whatever, whatever that woman is, um, they used her, he used her ID to, um, get into multiple things, like, get, maybe get some guns, maybe get some ammo, and that's a tree, but, um, yeah, and it's just really sad, so. And it's also, um, thinking about it right now, it's, um, Breast Cancer Awareness Month, so. I'm probably gonna make every car I have pink, because, um, I do have a family member that has breast cancer, so. Yeah. Life is tough, let me just tell you that right now. And. Because, of course, never surrender, but, um, yeah, um, this stuff makes us stronger. Like, these shootings, like, the people that die from this, they make our country stronger. They make, like, we learn from these attacks. Like, we learn from 9-11 to boost up our security and a bunch of other stuff. And, um, yeah, it's just a really, really sad time, and... Oh, ooh, oh, why is some guy following me? He's a fan. 
He's a fan. Hold on. Let me get him. Oops. Oh. That guy's going for a... Whoa! Oh, no. Yeah, boy, just just leave me alone. <gasps> but, uh, yeah, um... I can't believe someone would do that. Like, shoot up a whole concert and stuff. It's, it's not it's not funny. It's not amusing. You 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 definitely get attention for it, but you gain attention the bad way. Like after Paris, we kind of um like I'm talking about the U.S. <laughs> not Paris. I mean Paris. God, jeez, don't want to talk about. <laughs> Let's not get off topic here. But um, oh god, um. Yeah, my heart goes out to the people that probably shielded at least thousands of people that did not survive. Like, I mean, the loved ones, they're going to be, like, scarred for life, but they, they're going to be scarred for life, but they're going to, they're going to be lucky. They survived a mass shooting. And, yeah, they got, update on the guy, the guy got shot in his hotel room. By police. Good job, police. You're doing a good job. And, um, yeah, I can't believe someone would do that. I don't know why they would do that anyway. So, next time you think your life is, um, really screwed up, don't think about shooting anybody. Don't think about, like, murdering anybody. It's just, Get some help. All this guy needed was some help. If he got some help, if he he got some help, he would have um, he would have definitely um, wouldn't. He definitely would not have cre caused a mass shooting. But um, speaking of the guy, um, he was a lone wolf, really. He was, and he had a lot of money, which means he could buy at least. Which means you can buy all those guns and ammo. I mean, I wouldn't, personally, I wouldn't buy 12 guns, really. 12 guns. I would buy more ammo. I would buy ammo. But, um, no, 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 I'm not trying to, like, um, be, like, offensive or anything. I'm just saying, like, I'm just voicing my opinion out. But, um, it's just a really, really sad day. For the loved ones and everyone. And I feel very, very lucky that I am not in a mass shooting or a, a mass shooting or a thing like that. Like, God, jeez. It's really... Uh, like, who would do that? Who? I mean, ISIS would, but... Like, the terror groups, like, he was probably inspired by, like, a terror group, like, ISIS, Al-Qaeda, the one terrorist group in Africa, I don't know its name, but, um, yeah, why would you do that? So, it's very, very sad, very sad, and I hope that everyone is okay, well, everyone isn't okay, but, I mean, they're gonna be scarred for life, for sure. That's really all I had to talk about. Hope you guys did enjoy me ranting about a massacre for about 10 minutes. So, uh, we'll see you guys later. My heart goes out to the victims. I do.